Welcome everyone to Juno Sword Official. We are going to react to part 5. Not going to say much. We're just going to dive straight into it right now. I hope that you guys have enjoyed all the previous series and we're not going to react or look into a watch or educate ourselves or to learn more of part 5. Thank you. Let's go ahead. So, of course, this one is part 5. And of course, the prince went onto the ship, even if the ship was on fire. He believed and had faith that good will come out of it. He did not give up. Oh gosh, they're eating so much. But he's very attentive. Something is wrong. Birds flying so many in one direction. Something is on the something is happening. Even the fishes are swimming away. There is something behind them. Or something on the side or, or in front of them. Is it a storm? It is a storm. Yes, there's a storm coming in. They're not listening. I wonder if he can swim. I wonder. Stop drinking! <laughs> you all on the sea, you are drinking. Oh boy, hear that. You are all about to die, that's what it is. Do not be deceived by the bright weather of today because something might be coming tomorrow. Hmm, he's smart. He is smart. Wow, I did not know that. Wow, here comes the storm. You guys were not listening. Now you're all drunk and you are not ready. He warned you all. Oh boy. The storm is here. Oh, I hope the boat don't crash and then the mother receive the news that the boat crashed. This will be so heartbroken. Wow. You guys had the opportunity to, to go so ahead of this storm, but you did not listen. Oh gosh, start to sink? Forget about goods and treasures, your life that's important. You cannot swim then. How can you go on the sea and you cannot swim? Is that making sense? Wow. <laughs> this bird is so faithful. It's, it, it's, it's following them in all weather. Oh gosh, is that a wave? Holy cow! Oh gosh! She sent something. He'll find favor. Wow. Oh boy. Ooh. The boat is sinking. It, the ship is sinking. They were warning you guys, prepare. Prepare. No, you want to affect, enjoy and party rather than not be prepared. You have to be prepared when there is a pending disaster. 
prepare. Oh gosh, these guys are real warrior. Oh, there are fishes eating them. Oh shoot. Oh shoot, even if they. Oh gosh. Oh shoot. Oh gosh, even if they could swim, fish is eating them up. Oh gosh. Wow. So where is he? Let's see how he's going to get favored. I know he'll get favored. Something's going to happen. He's gonna swim. But what about the fishes? How is he gonna overcome those? Ooh, he concentrated. He did not lose focus. He's gonna jump, he's jumping, he's jumping in. So that means the fishes did not see him. Oh, I hope he have to meet the father before the father passes away. I hope he gets the truth. Wow, he's in his father, his brother. Oh gosh, he's calling him. I really was hoping he would get the words from his uncle that he did not kill the father. Yes, that's what I was saying. She's a queen, princess. Who wants to marry her already? The real king or the real heir to the throne is on his way. The real heir is on his way. He wished? Swim! That's a lot of swimming to do. Oh, there's something under the water. Oh, gosh, that's a fear of being in the water, bruh. Something under the water and you don't even know. What is that? What is that? Some kind of big... Is that a lawel? There's something coming up. Holy cow, look at the size of that thing. What is that? Oh, 
Oh, the, the fishes are coming, the fishes. I think he's gonna get favored. He would not come that far to be consumed by fishes. Oh, shoot! Oh! Oh, shoot! He's finding favor. Animals are fighting on his behalf, yo. Animals are fighting on his behalf. He is finding favor. Crab! So it's a crab, some kind of crab. This is some kind of eel. The eel wants him, but he will find favor. Go, 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 go. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, he took away a Gandhi. The eel is coming back. That's an ugly eel. Ooh. Swim, brother, swim. Ah! Cut it, neck, cut it. Cut it, neck. They both Wow. Damn, but I'll be scared, boy. I don't care even that they're to favor me, I'll be scared. So he got protection from this crab. What would be cool if a whale came and took him all the way to the kingdom so that he don't have to swim? But I guess sometime you have to. Oh no, he's getting exhausted. He must be exhausted. Is that a crab? It's back? Oh yes, it's back. but he's determined to go and go. He is persevering, yo. Wow. The king who swam across the ocean to ascend to the phone. What a story. And it's back in the weather again, back in a storm. So much fighting has to be done. That's what you call fighting for your phone. Wow. Oh gosh, lightning strike in the water. Go, go, go. You will make it. Go, go, go. Oh boy, that's his rough boy. Wow. Come on. He's gonna get favored again. Is he? Did he make it? Look like. Oh, okay. Okay, guys. So that is it. Part five. Okay, I know, I know, I know. Part six, so seven, eight, nine, ten. Like, all of them, they're coming, guys. They're coming. But right now, that is it for part five. Of course, that was an interesting journey. He found favor, and not just he finding favor and taking advantage of that favor. 
he showed that he is willing to endure and persevere and these are great honorable characteristic and trait to have even when you find favor even when things can be easily done you show that you can work for it for it and i'm so very glad that in this part of the video we see that the king the king who will ascend to the throne worked and pushed even when he has it good even when he has that resources to have everything at his advantage he decided he's gonna show power his side is going to show honor he's going to show perseverance and this is good and features even from king number the ninth i've seen videos where the king who has it all king number the ninth had it all he had everything but he still used all that he had for his people he had the opportunity to just stay in the palace eat and enjoy life but he went out there he was with his people he saw the struggle of his people and he worked and he worked and he worked for his people till the end of that last breath King Number the Ninth was a good example for the Thai people, and even me, he was a good example. And of course, this short series of video that we are watching, it was inspired from the work of King Number the Ninth, and that is an awesome, awesome thing to know. Thank you so very much. Of course, part six will come pretty soon. Thank you so very much. Bye, guys.